Hey everyone, GameBro here, and this is Let's Play Beautiful Joe. About to start the final episode. Yeah, quite a short game. So, what do I buy here? It's been several weeks since I record the footage. So, heck if I know exactly what I did. Beautiful Joe and Sexy Sylvia. Whoa. -oh. Yeah, in space. Very Star Wars like. Take a look at all those clones there. This room, as you probably guessed, can face an interim amount of enemies, so can grind for points as long as, um, as long as your heart's content. Anything in this room here, I'm mute. Since it's not defeating all the enemies, it's hard to make progress. Um, what is it? Um, there are three switches in this room that you need to put pressure on. And then you'll be able to get through. It may take you a while. It took me about five minutes. You need to reach great heights. Like what I'm like past me is currently doing. Um those trail of V films, um that is where you need to do the stomp attack. But um first time Gaining some V points and such, seeing what is all in those boxes. Because you can, why the hell not? In the last two. And I also could have got boomerangs, but I completely missed them. Dang it. But I got the bombs, which I believe I already had plenty of. I mean, bombs I'm not gonna make use of. And that thing got in the way. Yeah. That's what makes this um, gimmick annoying. Kind of annoying. Um, seeing if it can land on those switches. Start landing on those things. Um, does that count? Nope. Um, I'm not sure if slowing down does anything, but that's exactly what I do. And down for the third time. There we go. There's still two more though. Are those robs next to the clones, by the way? Sure look like those NES accessories. Who's preps? Um Except for maybe Snake, the character I use the least in Brawl. More goodies here. And there's switch number two. Yeah, you can use those things to help, re help you make great heights, but um, just try your damn distance. Make sure you don't land them while you're trying to put pressure on them switches. But at least they are marked um, where you're supposed to zoom in. And once again, it's not hard to find them. Um, it's easy to remember where you have to zoom in. Down, down, down. Now for the last one. When I need them, and they're not as much being a nuisance. Red out kick. And for the final one, really close to where we're gonna exit. 
Well, this room definitely could have took, taken a lot longer than it did. Still only got to see in time, though. Have I even gotten a crappy rating thus far? I don't remember. I don't recall getting these, um, I mean, I don't see how I'm gonna get these if I am not even bad enough to get C's. Yeah, like those, like those tanks in episode 5, but more, um, sci-fi-ish. Yeah, try to send enemies to them, things, um, if we can. As you can see, I'm struggling quite a bit. Jump, duck. Hells yeah. <laughs> and there's a pink box in the background if I... If past me... Didn't miss it. Come on out! Cannot see the HP on this one. Obviously. Hey, wait, Tom. Um, I seriously didn't notice. I seriously did not notice it. Whatever. And what do I know? No switches here. Um, that first room is the only time in the entire game where um there are switches required to be put pressure on. Yeah, it's a new gimmick and I uh, admire him for it. It's just kind of an annoying gimmick. Um, not knowing it, if you're going to make it or not on them switches. So am I going to skip... I'm gonna. Am I gonna skip that pink box um, entirely this time too? Yeah, here not my best performance. So I seriously didn't notice when I was able to get them background objects. Before, okay, okay, I was aiming for it, but um, it wasn't enough. I'm on fire, and I, not so much on fire. I'm literally on fire, but um, not so literally. Am I on fire? If that makes any sense? It probably does. And I have infinite VFX now. Two enemies are still there, so, um... Wait, can... Or was it the infant Vivex in the pink box? I'm not paying good attention. What the hell's wrong with me? I don't even remember. But anyway, um... Down from here... And... You'll be facing enemies with that cyclone move like Leo has. But if you keep zooming in and pow pow powing, you'll prevent them from being able to spend like a record on you. I, I shot off once, but time after that, I pretty much just um. I pretty much just annihilate him. Duck! Yeah, I willfully let him spin right round on me.
And don't forget these guys up here. That's more V points. I'm getting a crap load. Good thing I didn't open that box um when I first passed on by. Powering up with over 50,000 V points. If I get max speed level 3 and I failed to get the UK me move. Basically, if you zoom in, like, just before you hit the ground, you'll, um, you'll stylishly, um, get back up. And I have to lie down for a few seconds, um, stylish, but time I can live without it. Another pretty good opportunity to get a bunch of, to get a bunch of V-points. My memory doesn't kill me. We got time seven, but it still could have done better there. And there are legs on the way. Watch out for them. Come on, pass me. Do it beautifully. Eh, that was hardly beautiful. Oh, I'm missing. Some V films. Whatever they're called. Um. Yeah, it's time to take care of the big guys now. And trying to get through it like I just did. And about to uh, send fist flying. You know, look at the animations, you can pretty much tell what they're gonna do. Um, not to watch the option if you're in a large enough area. If like, the ceiling's not too low. Bombs are also pretty good at you to use. But one bomb wasn't enough. So I'm attacking females. They're still just robots, and they're trying to kill me, so... Yeah. Now I'm really on fire. That's a double meaning this time. Well, back to regular old Joe for a little bit. Yeah. He was slow down. Took a bit of my life there. Boomerang. Another Joker. This is one change much from the last Jokers we faced. Well, what changes there are wasn't enough to be in your sense. Um, okay, speed. Um, Flux really slow this time, so max speed is your best friend. This part. Um, so I was seeing if I can still try to get that last move that I didn't have enough for. Um, and holy crap, that was a lot of points there. Yeah, I could use a bit of restoring on my health. Why not? It's not using up that much time. Now, finally, let's get three Vs in a row. It's key here. That just magically opens the door for us. Pow, 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 pow. Uh, 
acting like an ape and ah yeah if you're near and they act like apes at the time um they will instantly somersault yeah and it it hurts a lot it's especially pain and re-rating which again I have never gotten past the boss rush road on that rating before um freaking shark Bruce to be more precise. And I'm gonna stop at a kind of a weird time. I should have stopped like when I first came in this room. Um I like don't even finish it. Um whatever. Um as you can see, um you need to hit the missiles and ill tech <clears throat> them spaceships in the background. Of course, um be sure to slow down time just before they make impact just before explosions occur. Do this for a little while. Um, avoiding lasers once again. I failed there. Take much longer if you don't slow down time. Yeah. Boom. Two missiles, um, slow it down, that's where it takes for them smaller spaceships. Beautiful bitch! Show me your moves. I should probably say it after the beating game. Whatever. This is Game Bro. See you all in the next video.